Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Dash Brennan. If you enjoy my content, let me know by hitting that like button. Thank you and enjoy the video. Hello everybody, welcome back to Dead Cells. I'm, I'm doing that a little bit pre-recording and making funny faces at myself. We're going to the Five Fjord. I haven't completed it yet, so we'll see how it goes. Hopefully... It goes well. That room went well. These guys, though. Hi. Ah, oh, that didn't even hit him. Oh, there it did. Oh, man, that was bad. <laughs> oh, that was that was interesting. We got we got a lot going on there. Um, if every room goes like this, then we're gonna be doing pretty good. But I know it won't. Hey, buddy, just uh, just hang out in the fire for me. All right. Okay, I guess. How far does that go? That thing goes all the way across the screen. Huh. Oh man, we got hit there. So it looks like the best way to deal with him, the easiest way, at least, is to uh, just kind of stun him if you can and kill him. It's the best way. <laughs> I do like a lot of these uh, AOE effects that we have nowadays. Oh, I thought he was going to hit me again. Blueprint acquired the spiked shield. Sweet. Yeah, we avoided that one. Alright, I, I went through this little hole. There we go. Hey, look at that. Just, just die already, alright? Alright, I forgot how to deal with those guys, so we'll, we'll have to figure that one out again. After we go into this room. Should we drink now? Maybe, but it's too late. Use the room. It's gonna be one of those rooms I won't be able to beat because it's a challenge area. That was almost the end right there. Ah, uh, there we go. We were doing pretty good. Now we'll drink. Then we'll go in here. Oh, wait. We never even went up. Might be upgrades. I need upgrades. Roll through the flying axe. Everything is for sale. Oh, man. Get a stat upgrade. Grab some more, uh, some more strength. I think kill things faster. And we don't need any HP. What was this? Damage taken reduced by 15%. Collecting cells and gold without needing to be in range. Oh, that would have been cool. Oh well, too late now. I don't really have a problem with collecting the gold and the cells usually, so. <laughs> With the extra strength, I think that helps on him. You know, we just took a hit there. Yeah. 
Yeah, you guys you take care of that auto cannon. Apparently, you cannot roll through that bomb. Oh, this is just a secret to get down here easier. Who would want to do that? Who would want to get down here faster? Oh man. We'll just do we'll just do some of that for starters. <laughs> Get him. Get him. Oh, that sucks. It's it's doing it. Yeah. We got him. I really don't know how to deal with this guy, this enemy. Nor do I really know how to get up there. I'll tell you one thing, this is not the way to deal with him. <laughs> to get hit by him repeatedly, it's, it's not the way. I really wish I knew how to get up there. I'm just not seeing it. Is there a chain I missed somewhere? Am I supposed to jump from the top of from the top of this one over here? I can't really tell. Maybe if I go over here I can jump up there. Get to the tallest point that we can. Yep, that didn't happen. Oh well. We're gonna keep moving along. As best as we can. There's another teleporter. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, auto turret. You got him. We get we got the meat grinder. That's cool. Didn't have that yet. Oh, that was that was pretty neat if I do say so myself. <laughs> What's that? I don't know what that is. Found a rare blueprint. Oil grenade. Ooh, that could come in handy with our build we got going right now. I was gonna say, I shouldn't, I shouldn't even be scared of this guy because he's not the one that I, I have a lot of problems with him. Then I got hit by him. So I guess he is someone I have problems with as well. Skill power and cooldown improved. Yeah. You guys got it. That worked out pretty well. Give me that. Give me that gold. That will be up high, maybe? Just press all the buttons. <laughs> press all the buttons you have. Oh, that's where we came in. I think that they made some new animation or sprites, if you will, for that vines. I think the vines look a lot better nowadays. That was painful. That's not where we wanted to go yet. Oh well, too late now. Okay, maybe we did want to go here. Get something cool. Or an infantry bow. 
You can see how I am not really that big of a fan of the bows. But now we can go up and down from right here. And right there. I guess the the best way to deal with that guy is to just try and get close to him, it seems. What's below us? Okay, that was the wrong move. Is there a teleport up in that area? Nope. We did drop those vines right here, though, so we can get back. We also should probably heal before we get too crazy over there. Oh, we're out of healing. Should we even go here when we have no healing? I don't know. There we go. Just let, uh, let our turret handle some of that. That was what we needed to be able to go down here. <laughs> the turret is uh, quite helpful, to say the least. I also like those knives quite a bit that we just throw everywhere. All that comes in handy. <laughs> really need some health though. Some health would be good right here. Hello. Oh, this is an exit to the, uh, to the level. I think we'll take it, because we need health. <laughs> and we can dump these cells that we have. So, I'm gonna say that we have successfully done the, um, the fjord now. And we got some cool stuff to go along with it. We got a spike shield, blocks attacks, and inflicts heavy damage. We got the meat grinder, an active skill, inflicts 102 damage per second and bleeding to enemies walking on it. Huh. And we got an oil grenade, which we don't have enough to unlock. So that's kind of disappointing. Hmm. I guess we'll just go ahead and put it into the potion for now. I'm not sure if this is the last level of the potion. Seems like it should be. And, uh... We're gonna head towards the graveyard. Got all of our flasks refilled. Got all of our health refilled. And we're heading to an area that I have not at all been to yet. And uh, that alone kind of scares me. And seeing all these guys that I haven't actually seen before scares me as well. Oh, I'm not liking this at all. There you go, just, just take one of those, if you don't mind. Those guys I don't mind, they're not too bad. I have to unlock this with a key. Oh, and he can still shoot me. That's not overpowered at all. Oh, those guys look big and scary. Wonder if he's gonna throw that thing. Oh, he's gonna hook me. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Everything went so bad so fast right there. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's pretty much our 15 minute video of uh, my adventure into the graveyard of uh, like three steps into the graveyard. Did real good guys, did real good. Uh, we ended up with the twin daggers this time. That's pretty cool. 
I like the twin daggers quite a bit, and they're twin daggers one. So that's, I guess everything that you start with is just going to be a one. Anyways, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time, and hopefully we'll get further than three steps into the graveyard, and or I'll do more exploring in the fjord, and see if I'm missing, I feel like I'm missing a skill. Like I have, see I've got the vine rune, I've got the teleportation rune, I feel like there should be another room, like a triple jump maybe? Anyways, I'll check you guys later. Bye-bye.